Hi, Justin with CNB Operations. If you're in the field and have your predictive ground speed on, but you want to learn how to get it to engage, we've got a couple different ways that you can make that resume when you're turning around at the headland on the field. So uh, default option that we've been seeing so far is going to be letter B up here on the hydro handle, um, but we can also change that. So we've had a lot of guys switch that to letter E here right next to your auto track button. So through your controls menu here, we can go ahead and then remove an assignment and then turn around and put that predictive ground speed automation on there instead. The other option that we have um, that can be useful just so it's one last thing to remember when you're turning around is if you go into your header setup here, your auto control, and then into machine, you can also enable it to resume when you use your two and three buttons on the hydro handle. So this works well once you get the field opened up and you don't want to have to remember to hit a second button there. For more information on predictive ground speed as well as setup and optimization of all the harvest automation technology with the new S7 combines, be sure to check out our YouTube channel for more information.